Hi. We got the police were harassing us today, selectively enforcing us, whatever they're enforcing, and giving us trouble, but no one else. And what exactly do you do? I'm an artist, and I make uh, jewelry, and I show kids how to make it. It's uh, I demonstrate how to make spiders and wire wrap. Okay, and you were set right over here. Yeah. At this. By the bench. By the bench, okay. And I was told to pack up, so I did. And I asked the police why they're not checking with the people just south of me, a few feet, who have prices listed, and they have no signs like I do that it's for a donation. I have two signs that I showed to the police. It's on my table, and they didn't bother them at all. How can they justify selectively enforcing the law? And I asked him for a copy of the law, and he won't give it to me. Did anybody else see him do this? Yes, Donovan. Am I being on video? Okay. Did, they Did you see him do it? Yeah, I'm, I'm an artist, and I do caricatures, and I display my artwork out here for credibility. And the major thing is I make stuff by hand, I know Jeff does also. He does hand wire work, he does hand stone work. Uh, he's an artist. I'm an artist, and I can tell I'm an artist. Uh, and the other people do no handwork on their work. They sell pewter statues, which anybody can order. Sunglasses. And also sunglasses and melted bottles that they also buy off the internet or whatever. So I don't see how they could select us, single us out, and not hit anybody else. I talked to all the vendors down the whole harbor boardwalk here today, and nobody else has been bothered. And several of them have twice as many tables piled twice as high of all kinds of things that were store-bought, not handmade at all. And to single us out is outrageous. I don't see how we would get hit and none of them would hit. It's really against our rights. And the other thing that bothers me about it is we don't have any prices listed. We have donations all over our, our table and we show demonstrate how to do these things. None of these other people do that. They all have prices listed, no donations mentioned. They have prices on the bottom of their jewelry with these people right next to me. You know, why would they hit us and no one else? I don't understand this. I don't understand either. We'll have to get to the bottom of it. Let's start by taking a look at what uh, what else is going on around here. Okay. Can you take him down to this cool, one? Sure. Oh, to, to Mike's too. Yeah, we'll go on. Through the do the pick wherever it shows money or you know, then he can see that they don't have this. Well, money. you know Mike, right? Yeah. Yeah. Let's, let's I'm, go down I'm here. Gonna, I'm going to let you. Go. Okay. Yeah, I'll be right back. Yeah. Okay. He, he has nothing to say to us. Yeah. But yeah. Okay. What's your name? Mike. Mike. And what kind of art do you do? I do uh, name products. I do photo names and hand painted names. Photo names and hand painted names. That sounds pretty cool. Um. <laughs> So you just like drops people's names with pictures on them or stuff like yeah, that? I, I hand paint these and uh, the photo ones have taken all the photos myself. So it's all created by me. Okay. Um, have the cops ever come and harassed you or said anything to you? I don't believe they've ever harassed me, but they have come and questioned me and asked me about my process. Okay. Um, so they've never like asked you for a permit or? No. Oh, when I first set up two years ago, because then they required a permit. And but, do they tell you you need a permit now, like no. when you talk to them? No. Okay, that's all I need to know. Awesome. Thank you. Some people do, some people just use them now. Do you live on there? If I bought something like that, I definitely would live on it. Do you have anything else? Hi.
Did she fire him up in a kiln? Yeah. yeah. Hi, these are amazing. Turquoise. Oh. Is she going to come back? Yeah, she's talking right now. Let me call her. That's cool. That's beautiful. That's what people need to learn. Wow. 